is Canada's last great frontier. Unspoiled, unlimited potential. The North is brimming with hope. Across the land, from the eastern shore to the prairie heartland, and the mighty metropolis, there is the warmth of a winter people to count on. And for the first time, the entire country will live at the frontier and know it beyond its frosty limits. In the Yukon, the youth of the nation is all fired up for the Canada Games. Three territories as hosts, these are a pan-northern Canada Games and the torch has traveled a great distance all the way from the Arctic Circle across the land and sea to get to Whitehorse. It arrives by bobsleigh, by runner, by cross-country skier to the shore of the Yukon River and these Canada Games. Now it will preside over the north for two wonderful weeks. Mesdames et Messieurs, veuillez accueillir le Président de la Société Hôtesse. Please welcome the President of the 2007 Canada Winter Games Host Society, Piers McDonald. At this time of year in the North, we look forward to each day's increasing light. Since last spring, a special light has been traveling across the North a light gathering force and strength as it moves from community to community. Three torches, representing the three northern territories, were lit in alert at the tip of Ellesmere Island on April 10, 2006, and traveled separate journeys over land, water and air to be brought together tonight. As the torches traveled through communities and unique places, carried in the spirit of celebration and unity, each torch bearer each community, each region brought its own energy to add power to this special flame. From torch light to celestial light, the light from the northern sky brings hope and promise, inspiring dreams and building champions. As we celebrate the Canada Games here in Canada's north, we celebrate the Northern Lights. Having brought the spirit of the Games to over 80 communities, 13 unique places throughout the North, and having traveled over 100,000 kilometers, we welcome the three Northern Torches of the 2007 Canada Winter Games. Mesdames et Messieurs, les flambeaux pan nordiques des Jeux d'hiver du Canada 2007. Le porteur du flambeau du Yukon, carrying the first torch, representing the Yukon from Whitehorse, 12-year-old short track speed skater, Heather Clark. And the torch is carved by sculptor Shane Wilson, all using caribou antler. And Heather Clark, the 12-year-old short track speed skater, carries in the Raven. The Raven oversees 13 mountain chips of the boreal forest and this is the torch of the Yukon arriving by a traditional northern mode of transportation and now arriving up. by Yukon dog team from Dunamut nine-year-old Simon to Bert and the, the porteur du flambeau des territoires du nord-west and from the northwest territory seven Speed skater Rebecca Mahler. There are the Huskies now. Simon Tepperchip. What a moment for this nine year old. And the 17 year old speed skater Rebecca Mahler will carry in Polar Bear. Polar Bear clamors on to secure footing from an ice pan that broke into 13 pieces. Again, representing. All of the provinces and territories gathered here under one roof in the Yukon. Rossi, wouldn't that be a moment for Simon Pepper Jr.? Well, will never forget this I bet you. And, and I don't think he'll ever, ever be like that. When, like a few days ago, I think he was quite cold the other day. And 
little nervous. He was in tears when I heard. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we would like to share this moment in tribute to a dear Yukoner and a special friend of the Games. In honor of Peter Milner, whose dream was to bring the Games to the north, the Roley McClanahan torch will be carried in by Peter's young granddaughter, Ava Milner. Peter, who died in February of 2005, believed that the Games would inspire people and help make our communities a better place to live. Today, his dream is a reality. Peter's family is with us today at Atco Place, and we share this special day with you. Peter's positive energy and enthusiasm will remain with all of us as we light the cauldron celebrating the opening of the 2007 Canada Winter Games. Ladies and gentlemen, the Roley McClenahan Torch and Ava Milner. these parts, dreamed of having the games in the north. Allemand la flamme des Jeux d'hiver du Canada 2007. We now light the flame of the 2007 Canada Winter Games. Ladies and gentlemen, Barbara Chamberlain and follow...